The zoom scroll command allows you to move sideways in your drawing without zooming in or out. It is particularly useful if you have already zoomed in and need to see something that is just off the edge of the screen. It can be used in three different ways. When this command is selected, the crosshair changes its shape to a magnifying glass and the prompt tells you to locate the start of the scroll direction, press control or drag to start dynamic scroll. The first way to use the command is to click a position on the screen. The prompt now tells you to locate the end of the scroll direction and a rubber band follows your crosshair. This rubber band indicates the direction and distance the drawing will scroll when you next click. The prompt again tells you to locate the start of the scroll direction. Press control or drag to start dynamic scroll so you can continue to scroll your drawing. Right click to stop scrolling in this way. The second way to use the command is to hold down the control key and click your left mouse button roughly in the centre of the screen. You can then release the control key and the prompt tells you to move the mouse to scroll the image. The image is now attached to your crosshair and moves with it. Click your left mouse button when you are happy with the screen display and this will stop the command. The third way to use the command is to simply hold down your left mouse button and move your mouse. The screen image is attached to your crosshair as before, but will only move with it as long as you keep your left mouse button held down. Releasing your left mouse button will stop the scrolling, but the command remains active so you can scroll again if you need to. Right click to stop the command. The scroll command can be used at any time and can be used separately or during another command. For example, after starting to draw a line, you could scroll across your drawing to locate the end of the line. That completes this tutorial.